But we have, let's see if I can get close enough, we have some monsters coming up. Wish those sticks weren't in the way. <laughs> I think Joe probably raked them there and then just never, but just didn't remember to pick them up. But there's two hostas there. Well, you can see my new attempt to get my hair out of the way. Sorry about the smile. I haven't got my teeth in yet. <sighs> Forgot. <laughs> so. Anyhow, it is really nice out. The, if I remember right, I filmed out here few days ago and I said something about the, the leaves were just starting to show you know just starting to come out of there and now the tree is just loaded see now all of them all of them are loaded now but we have See if I can get close enough. We have some monsters coming up. Wish those sticks weren't in the way. <laughs> I think Joe probably raked them there and then just never, but just didn't remember to pick them up. But there's two hostas there. So some have survived. I will check in with you later and I will probably be in working on that zebra some today zebra i keep saying it's a zebra i need to make a zebra but this is not a zebra it's a giraffe <laughs> i already made the long neck i know <laughs> let's not put the short neck back on him well this is what we got out of it guys <laughs> And it probably won't last long because my hair doesn't hold curl unless it's had a perm. And I did not put any makeup on. Deal with it. <laughs> my camera's going to be mostly down here anyway. I'm going to try and do some more work on that giraffe today. Oh, and I did get some good goodies. I got some got glossy glaze. Satin glaze and clay adhesive. So I got some goodies. Got to thinking I might have done better to have bulked this out with some foil, but I still can't. I've been finding out some wonderful things about working with this stuff. I don't think I need to bulk his neck a lot because that'll get bulked out enough by the clay. Where I want to bulk him out a little is here in his tummy area. I just broke this. You know, there's a wire through it, so it will be fine. There, bulk out his tummy area so that it doesn't take quite as much clay. I need to remove some of this. Here.
Hello, I'm going to be a giraffe. No, I, <laughs> okay. I think I'm going to make him more yellow than anything. Well, we'll mix about the same amount of orange and yellow together. From here on through a lot of it, I forget to talk. I'm just, I'm just doing what I'm doing and I'm not thinking to talk about it. But what I've done is I rolled out, I took some instruction from another person, but I took the instruction wrong. And I rolled it out using cornstarch to keep it from sticking to the deal. But now it don't want to stick to the, to the mold either. So anyway, we're getting it figured out. Okay, got some more mixed, and I turned my thing over to a cleaner side. I'm going to try rolling a little of this out again, because it just goes on nicer. Just roll a little strips up. Now it wants to stick. No. Okay, here we go. I don't think I need any more on his neck. The good thing is you can smooth it. And blend it. And then I'll go get some. I'm just going to continue filling out the the creature so I'll give you some more music
Okay, it's hard for me to keep a narrative going on my own while I'm making it, so, but I do want you to know what I'm doing. Okay, I have bulked out his neck and his head, and I think for a giraffe, I could have maybe made a little bit longer neck, but it is what it is right now. But I'm booking out the body, what I'm, and what I'm trying to do there right now is get the tail in and put on more for the, for the hip and the shoulder here in a little bit. Because the legs kind of make that shape up around there where they kind of attach it, and it would be called the hip or the joint there. So I want to bulk those parts out so they look natural when, or as natural as I can make them look, it is going to look like a cartoon type figure, but that's kind of the point. But I still want it to be able to be a recognizable beast. So this beastie is getting to be, become beastly. <laughs> it's a beastly beast. There I'm going for the shoulder to bulk it out some. The head, I will be later on, later on we'll add the ears and the, those little horn things, I don't know, I guess kind of like knobs in between the ears. I have no idea if they have any function, but on a giraffe that's what you find. And then at some point when I've got him done, pretty much as far as shaping him out and baked and all of the adjustments made, then I will try to paint him myself as far as putting the spots and stuff on him. So we will we'll see how I do with that because I am not an expert painter at all. Hope you have enjoyed this, and we'll be back next time with some more giraffe. Well, I hope you enjoyed our day. I hope you enjoyed being out with me on the porch and looking out at the hostas and trees. And I was working on the giraffe my sim card on the or memory card on the camera got full i continued where i had no idea <laughs> i kept working but i really didn't get much farther after what you just saw he's giraffe's going to take a couple times <laughs> so i want to do him right and i want to but i'm just excited to be able to paint on some of his spots instead of adding it all with clay and that kind of stuff. I'm a little scared of painting because my hands are shaky, but I think if I don't overload the brush, I might be able to pull it off. So, I enjoy your company when you, I just love the comments that I've been getting and about this zoo. You guys just so, seem so excited about it and I am too. I don't want it to be all zoo, that's why I went outside for a little bit, but I'm going to do that whenever it's nice weather, <laughs> or whenever I know it's nice weather. And so, good night, and we will see you. Please do subscribe, and click that notification bell if you haven't already, and give us a thumbs up. And then turn around and give yourself a thumbs up. Say, this is my thumbs up, and I did okay to earn it. That's for you to say, but I'll wait for your thumbs up for my video. I'm being silly. I'll see you next time. Good night.